Most people who take a prescription painkiller, even those who occasionally misuse them for recreational purposes, can stop without much difficulty. Such is not the case for the 5% to 10% of individuals with a biological predisposition to addiction. Addiction is not a matter of choice or lack of willpower. It's a chronic disease affecting the brain's chemical makeup and cognitive functioning that is characterized by irrational, compulsive behavior, which continues despite increasingly harmful consequences. Prescription painkillers, or opioids, are derivatives of opium. They act on the nervous system to suppress the intensity of pain signals reaching the brain and simultaneously to stimulate areas of the brain associated with pleasure. In an addiction-susceptible person, the brain's reward system hijacks normal thought processes to prioritize repetition of the pleasurable activity and eventually to perceive it as essential to survival, as breathing. The shorter the period of opioid abuse, the better the chance of overcoming addiction. Treatment is not a quick fix. The best approach depends on the needs of the individual and may involve detoxification to address the physical dependence, individual and group psychological counseling, and the careful use of medication-assisted treatments such as Suboxone. Relapses, especially within the first several years, are common. This can make the process frustrating for those already adversely affected by the person's addiction. However, support systems of family, friends, and professional behavioral health care specialists are an integral part of recovery. To learn more about painkiller addiction, visit the Information Center at carrierclinic.org. <laughs>